Hello friends and fellow bee lovers. Welcome back to Wind Walker Farm. Today is April 14th. It is Sunday. We had an overnight low of 56 degrees, which was a little chilly for the bees. But it is now around noon and has warmed up to 78. So it is very pleasant right now. Today we're going to be getting back into our brand new beehives. Hives 3 and 4. These are the ones that it's been 16 days since we put these girls in their new home. So we're going to have a first look at how they've been doing. Um, remember these were five frame nukes. So they had five brand new frames and five regular frames that they were already on. So we're going to see how they've expanded and how they're getting along. So not too much further ado. I'm going to get suited up, light my smoker. We're going to get in here, so I'll see you in a minute. Hey, I'm trying a new thing today where I'm going to wear the camera on my chest. So hopefully you'll see what I see, but it's a struggle to get into this thing. But hopefully it works. If it does, we'll do this more often. All right, let's give these girls a few puffs of smoke. Some gentle ones at the door. Little knock knock. We've done some too. Okay, this is hide number three. The one with the pretty pink frame that I still don't know is if it is significant or not. If it was a green frame, they make uh well, you just want to attack the hive tool, don't you? If it was a green frame, I'd say it was specially made to be drone comb. And there's a special purpose for a frame that is meant to be drone comb. I have a 
Let's see how we go about later. Boy, these girls are a little bit spicy today. Okay, they've started on the first frame. I can't tell if they've started to build that out or if that's the wax I put on there originally. That might be wax that I painted on there. built out more than I had it. Wow, these girls are really going into an uproar. This frame has pollen. So upset. Other than they seem to hate the camera. Like some of my videos you'll see me pull a frame of bees out and they don't fly at my head or try to get around the bee suit, but they sure will fly directly at the camera lens. Like it's an eyeball of a creature that's attacking them. And that's why I like to wear the bee suit, because they will fly, if they don't like it, they'll fly and sting you right in the eye. Okay, we're getting somewhere now. We got a pretty heavy frame. Excuse me, girls. This frame has C-shaped larva, cap, larva, brand new cap. I don't know what they're building there. in this little group right here. What are you girls doing? Huh? What are you girls doing? Is the queen around? Is the queen around? Is that what you're clustered like that for? Pollen on this side. frame. It looks a little bit more discolored than the other ones. But I think the pink one was the middle frame. So that might have been a frame that they had with them when they came here. Should be able to hear how loud they are.
like some larger ones might they might have made a couple of drones the drone cells are bigger but it's not big enough to be a queen cell so. Always a, keep a lookout in case they try to make a queen cell. I don't want to see the other side of this frame, but it's so heavy. It's fun figuring out where you can put your hands, fingers, so you don't squish any bees. They are getting in that camera lens, like I think they might be. It might be a rough video to watch. shapes in the bottom of those cells that tell me there's larvae down there. Which means towards the top. There ought to be eggs. Take your fingers and you pick up the frame. Take your fingers and come in real gentle and scoot the bees out of the way. And when you grip down, you don't have a bee. Same way over here. Slide the finger. Slide. Put it down on the corner. one they'll make a sound a little vibration against your finger like a little joy buzzer
There's the queen. Oh, there she is. Up on the top corner. Right there. Look at that big old behind. And put the queen on this frame. There's one with some pollen on its legs. Her legs. There she is. Go queen you go. Alright. Back on the middle of the frame. I'm going to set you back in here gently. Definitely do not want to squish the queen. all the swarm of bees that's trying to tell the camera to go away. Like, no paparazzi. We don't want you filming us. Pretty empty. comb off the bottom of the frame. How about no? Let's not do that. Alright. These are definitely when they're storing pollen, those little bumps. Probably pollen blobs that came off the forager's legs. You pack it in there and chew a little nectar into it. And ferments a little bit. And we call that bee bread. And we're starting to... So they're starting to add wax to this side of the frame. Where it looks like it's capped over. That's where... My roller whirling on the wax just gave a little too much so moved up it looks like they added around it on top of it I don't remember putting that heavy of a coat on there but they have little wax glands on the very bottoms of their back where the wax they secrete the wax from and pretty much as they walk around it gets on stuff. They can manipulate a little bit. Oh, there's a hive beetle. I see you hive beetle. 
Now I'm going to put some murder sauce in here and make this the end. I think you're going to make high beetle babies. You can think again. Okay, so they haven't got that frame. They haven't done anything with that frame, I'm pretty sure. Same way, they haven't done anything with that frame. So. I am going to... Let's see. That frame came from this side. Those two frames belong on that side. Real quick here. Excuse me, girls. Excuse me. Get out the way. Move your tiny bee butts. Hate that camera. They are following me. Actually, following the camera. And it looks to me like they tried to sting the camera. So. I don't know if wearing the camera like this is actually a great idea might be might be better in the video well, I can tell you that they are not liking it one little bit See how runny this is? I think I'm going to try mixing another batch with Crisco. And hopefully this doesn't get all over the place before I... It's not for you. It's not for you. I don't want you to have that. It's to kill hive beetles. Yeah, if I was not wearing my bee suit today, they would these girls would have lit me up. We got some spicy bees. Spicy bees. Can I have my tool back? Can I have my tool back? back together. Mm. See how I do this when I put the tool on there? I'm not squishing any bees because I get it in there. And I know there aren't any in there. Just slide it and the frames are all together already. So, no more of these are between the frames.
we'll usually put the cover on to try and avoid hurting them. Start at an angle. And then come down and kind of move side to side. I know it's resting on the wood, so there's none underneath of it. And then I do a sort of slide. Get it all the way over the edges. I can walk around. Let me see. Right in there. And I'm gonna get you guys out. Try to get them to go back in. Fly away. Yeah. 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 Shut the door. Shut the door. Oops. 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 it up. Spicy bees. Put this back together. I'll put it. Put some more sugar water in there. Once they have chilled out. Oh, see what I did? You see what I did? I did all that and then left that sticker sucker in there. is a wrap for hive number three. Doing pretty good. Come down here and say sorry I bothered you so much. Yeah, it's all over now. You can return your regular bee duties. And now we'll move that smoker so we get that smell out of the hive. Okay, wow, I'm so glad I was wearing the full suit. I've never seen the bees that riled up. Granted, I'm brand new at this. Uh, it's the first time they've ever been that agitated inspection. I don't know if it was the camera that I was wearing that was right there. I did see a bird fly away later. It looked like this, a gray cat bird, according to theory. So I think maybe that's what had them agitated. Uh, they were definitely not happy with the camera. I had to walk over to the corner of the yard and just stand there for about 10 minutes before they finally stopped coming after the camera because I couldn't go in the house. They were just all over me. So I only ended up doing the one inspection today. But we'll get to that one in a couple weeks. They're, they're doing fine. I see them on the landing boards. Here I can show you. They're coming in and out. Got pollen, that one's got pollen.
they're just doing they're just doing their bee thing so i'm gonna close this video out if you like what you saw today like and subscribe tell me what you thought about the camera close-up view um, and i'll try that again when i get into this hive but i think i might try to disguise the camera better put some shroud around it or something white maybe disguise the look but tune in next time and i will see you then